Hey guys, hope you're well and welcome to this commission showcase video. I have an absolute treat for you today. We've got a Black Templars kill team with loads of unique models for you guys to check out. If you're new to the Siege Studios YouTube channel, then firstly, welcome. Siege Studios is a UK-based premium commission miniature painting service with 30 painters who all paint from our bronze premium gaming level all the way up to platinum, which is our competition entry quality. If you are interested in a commission with us, then all you need to do very simply is in the description of this video, click where it says get a quote. That link will take you directly to the Siege Studios website and our contact Form. All you need to do once there is complete the contact form by selecting the relevant drop down options from those available for your project and in the message section, including a list of models in our model list format. Once that's sent off to us, we'll come back to you with a quote and get the process started. We're back very shortly to have a look at these awesome Black Templars in more detail. See you guys back in a sec. So without further ado, let's dive in and have a look at this awesome Black Templars kill team. Uh, it's been worked on by Nick, one of the artists here at Siege. Uh, there's loads of distinct models in the group of uh, miniatures, which is really, really cool. A nice selection of older models, newer models, and uh, very, very iconic heraldry and things that's been done on them. Uh, so we've got two scouts, uh, a couple of reavers, uh, a couple of intercessors, and also some uh, some standard marines as well, which is really, really cool. Uh, so let's move forward and have a look at some of these great kill team members. Uh, we've just got one of the reavers here as well, which is really lovely, and Nick's done a nice job of just sculpting some tabards and things onto uh, various amounts of models in this force as well, as per our client request. Uh, all the little details all picked out in a lovely fashion, all the sort of the purity seals and everything with text on them as well, which is really lovely. Uh, we've got obviously uh, Vican here, uh, Balkan, sorry, beg your pardon, we didn't read the L. Uh, so that's Balkan, just one of the uh, one of these kill team members, which is really, really cool. Chainsword and bolt pistol there, as you'll see. Obviously all chained on. Uh, we've actually done some converting as per the client request and put some chains onto these as well, uh, as they are Black Templars, as you'll see. But all the pouches all highlighted in a really lovely fashion as well. So that's just this uh, this reaver from the squad as well. Uh, let's have a look at the two scouts as well. So you've just got Sigard here as well. Really, really cool model. Uh, all the details, as you can see, painted. Uh, extra little Black Templar pieces added on. All the scripture and stuff done on the purity seals uh, moving around. All the little uh, lights and things are done as well. Little lights on the back of his armour all painted. Scratches on there as well. All the rope and different details all picked out templar cross put on there as well and uh, all the writing on the purity seal was just on this guy as well on sigard again a really 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 cool model um i've got the next scout from them it's uh mag uh, magneric uh which is really really cool so that's him uh, you can see all these little details are all painted eyes teeth lips and everything all done he's also got some stubble that's been put on him as well which is really really cool all of his weapons all chained onto him as well as you'll see this is obviously just chain that we've added on there as per our client request uh, all the details painted uh, nice amount of highlighting on these guys as well which is really really cool just to make that black stand out uh, and not detract from the black as well which is really important um, so obviously the boots and everything were highlighted lovely as well so that's just him and then let's pull forward. Probably one of the most iconic things you'll see from a Black Templar is that heraldic cross on the helmet there, as you can see on this chap as well. This is uh, Barisan. Really, really cool uh, model from the unit as well. All the little bits of detail. Nice little bit of text there just on the knee pad as well. Uh, just add a little bit of extra detail there. But again, you can see the lovely, super sharp highlighting that's been done all the way across this armour. All the text and everything added onto those uh, purity seals and uh, nice areas of highlighting gems and lenses and everything done as well to a lovely, lovely fashion. So that's just uh, that's just this awesome Barisan model. Uh, moving through to the next chap, let's have a look him. This is Reynold, um, really, really cool with a flamer as well, fully magnetized. So these are all interchangeable, as you see it's obviously loose, but it's all magnetized so that our client can change weapons. Nice little bit of flames there on the base as well, just a little spillage from his flamer. Uh, and then moving around, you can see he's got bionic legs as well, which is really, really cool. He's obviously been through the wars. Um, all the text and everything done on those uh, tapestries are there, just hanging from the back of his armor as well. But all the little lenses and everything painted, nice point of light source and reflection on the uh, helmet lenses. Again, every little bit of detail fully painted on these guys, which is really, really cool. So that's just him. The next Reaver from the unit. So let's have a look at this gentleman. This is Salzar. Uh, again, really, really cool Reaver. Again, little extra details all painted. Purge written on his uh, pad there, as you'll see. I love the conversion here where you've got, um, rather than the Reaver arm with a knife, it's been added to the scabbard of one of the swords as well, which is really, really a nice little easy conversion, but just adds so much uh, narrative to this Black Templar model as well. Uh, so that's just him, and you can see all the chains that have been added onto both arms to just hold on, obviously, those weapons. Uh, a little bit of text on the shoulder pad there as well, and obviously the sculpted um, 
sculpted cloth work on him as well, uh, just to add that Black Templar feel to this chap as well. So that's just uh, him. Next one of the intercessors, we're gonna have a look at this guy as well. Really, really cool, this is Angrad. Uh, again, really nice pose here, very defiant, looks like he's just looming forward to uh, to engage someone. Again, you've got all the, the sculpted uh, cloth work that's been done on him, you've got the chains and everything that's been added to his wrist as well there. The little lens is all painted on the bolter. Uh, all the little extra details here done as well. Text on the uh, Black Templar filigree and stuff on there as well. But again, really, really lovely clean finish that Nick's achieved on all of these for our clients. So that's just him. Uh, move back to the heavy bolter wielding chap from a squad. And again, this is magnetized, so you can see it's all magnetized, so it can be changed around. And this is Halric. Uh, you see with his heavy bolter, lovely, lovely attention to detail on all those lenses as well, which has been done in a really lovely fashion. So that's just uh, another little touch to add to him with a point of light source and blending on those lenses. A uh, little bit of text just on that shoulder guard there. Moving around, you can see every little bit, bit of detail painted as well. Nice uh, cross there on the on the pad that's been freehanded on as well. Uh, and then we've obviously got the rear with the little screen there with all the little lights on the uh, ammo loader for the heavy bolt up, plus also all the text and everything done on the purity seal as well, and on that purity seal as well there, as you can see. Uh, so that's just Halric. And then probably my favourite from the uh, from the unit as well is this gentleman here, because I do absolutely love his pose. Uh, this is Tiberius, really, really cool. Uh, inspiring uh, Black Templar with massive, massive sword there with that power on the power node as well, as you can see. Nice, subtle sort of tinge to that black blade. Uh, again, you can see all the chain work that's been added onto that wrist as well. All the text on the purity seals, as you'd expect with us here at Siege, and the names on the bolters and things like that. Moving around, you can see the, the sculpting that Nick's done just to add that sort of cloth work to the uh, to the model as well, which is lovely. Again, lovely red casings on these bolters as well, just to complement and really make the weapons stand out. And very easy to distinguish in, in the in the in the kill team the weapons that they've got, lenses and everything fully painted as well, which is really lovely. Uh, so that's just uh, Tiberius again, ex Death Watch as well, which is really really cool on him. Uh, so great amount of narrative. And the thing I do really like about him, which gets to focus, is he has loads of scripture all tattooed onto his forehead as well. Uh, probably all of his previous victories or foes that he's slayed or heretics that he's purged from the galaxy. Uh, so that's just him. And again, the eyes and everything all fully painted on him, as you'll see. Uh, and then we'll move to have a look at this awesome chap here uh, from the unit. Again, um, it's a Wolf Wolfger, which is really, really cool. That's a great name. Again, all these uh, all these plates are from Versatile Terrain, if you're wondering and you're typing away in the comments to find out where they're from. Uh, we'll put a link in the description so you can find this and these as well. Again, you've got this chap here, again, with his, uh, obviously he's got his bolt out and obviously the grenade launcher, but extra grenades and things just to really make him stand out in the unit. Uh, again, nice amounts of detail work on the leg, a little bit of scratching done to the armor as well, text on the uh, kneecap there, all the grenades and everything fully painted, and then moving around, you've got that uh, Black Templars pad that he's got there as well. And again, you can see all the lenses done, but all the eyes and everything fully painted. Actually, got a scarred eye as well, which is quite cool. Uh, Nick's just done that, that uh, head, so he's got like a scarred eye, so he's only got one eye, but uh, he's still being given a uh, very powerful weapon. So that's just uh, that's Wolfga, really, really cool kill team for, um, for our client uh, in a very, very unique sort of amount of detail work on each model. So I do really, really hope that you like them. We're back in a second to find out a little bit more about how you can take out commission with us here at Siege and see this awesome kill team in more detail. See you guys back in a second. So thanks for checking the video out guys, I really, really appreciate it and uh, I do hope you like this very dynamic and distinctive Black Templars kill team. I know that Nick had a really good time working on each of them individually as characters and as unique models, plus also the great little name plates that are from Versatile Terrain, so if you do want to check those out, we'll put a link in the description for those as well. Uh, now if you're interested in a commission with us, all you need to do very simply is head to the description of this video where there's a link where it says get a quote, that will take you directly to the Siege Studios website and our contact form. Once you're there, very simply, all you need to do is complete the contact form by selecting the relevant drop down options from those available for your project and in the message section include a list of models in our model list format once that's fired off to us we'll come back to you with a quote and get the process started also in the description you can find the links to our social media so instagram twitter and also facebook if you want to go give us a like and follow respectively on those social media platforms then you can keep up to date with all the things that we do as a business and finally while you're here on youtube do us a huge favor subscribe to the channel hit the bell icon so you get notified when all the new videos go up and also give the video a thumbs up. Thank you ever so much for watching the video and I will see you very soon in the next showcase video. Take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.